Hi everyone, I am April Hunt from Mermaid Mama Designs and I am going to do my first unboxing video. I received a package from my favorite shop, CottonCandyFabrics.com. It's run by Lydia and Paul Corey, two of my favorite people. They have the best customer service you can imagine. They're super fast. Uh, this was here in two days, I believe, and it was a huge, well, huge for me order. Um, I'm super excited. Uh, I also got some other fabrics I wanted to show you all. This is the new Lily Baby print with the jellyfish on it. Um, I also got the Magic Collection. I don't know if you can see them. Castle Plan. Uh -huh. These are pre-washed, of course, but they're hanging and dry. Let me see if I can show this to you. These, this is my favorite one. <laughs> There's narwhals and mermaids and metallic stars. It's gorgeous. This is the castle plain print. Uh, that's also got a metallic sheen to it. Uh, Twilight Garden. Um, unicorns, of course. Baby dragons and constellations. This is a striped bouquet print from Hobby Lobby. It's uh, a custom favorite. I have this one requested over and over again. <laughs> Um, these are also, these are my personal stash. Uh, this is an avant-garde print by Art Gallery Fabrics. I'm not even sure what the name of this is, honestly. But isn't it gorgeous? Um, I don't know if you can see all the detail. There's little triangles and arrows on it. It's got that turquoise and purple that just really pop together. Um, this is one that I have put up for my custom orders as well. Um, Neo flies. I think it's called. <clears throat> you can't even see in the picture, but it's just it's gorgeous. The navy, kind of a dark teal background, and it's got turquoise and light blue butterflies on it. It's gorgeous. It goes with this other avant-garde print. This is called Teal Blender. Another one they just kind of have to see in person. That's why I'm making this video. Um, I hope you can see the colors. It's just gorgeous. Those three kind of coordinate with each other. Um, this is also new ones by Andover Fabrics. It's called Unicorn Hunt. I believe because there's not very many unicorns in it, you kind of have to hunt for them <coughs> in the fabric. That's one of my favorites. Uh, Wildflower Garden. I believe maybe Michael Miller. Let's see. Oh, no, Riley Blake Designs. I've started working with nothing but quality fabrics. And I tell you what, you can really, between this from Hobby Lobby and this, I mean, you can feel that you can't see it maybe, <laughs> but you can feel the difference. This is a thicker fabric. It holds up better to stitching, washing, wear and tear. Um, I also got a bunch of new flannels in stock. I'm going to start backing some of my stuck pads with flannels. I wanted to get some coordinating prints. Uh, just pink and white polka dots. Uh, navy and white. This is for a fun project that I'm going to be working on, which is a double gauze baby blanket. Oh, uh, the fabric should be in this box. I'm super excited. Um, a cupcake print, because cupcakes are always fun. I got a ton of this. I'm excited about that. Um, monkeys. Monkeys always go well. This is the monkeys on a turquoise background and sharks and pirate monkeys. It's a ship ahoy. Super cute. And some pink polka dots. Uh, now, for your viewing pleasure, <laughs> uh, my cotton candy shipment. Doing okay down there? I tried to open this in the dark so I didn't look crazy trying to open it on the camera. Oh my goodness, I love getting these packages. She can pack a box, let me tell you. I'll just take them out one at a time. <laughs> Everything is sealed in plastic. Okay, let's start with one of my favorite, Garden Blueberry by Michael Miller. This is a Tula print, and it is gorgeous. I made one pair of duck pads with this, and I'm addicted. I had to get a whole other yard of it. <laughs> um, let's see if I can show you closer. Up. It's got little bunny rabbits and doves, and the pink just absolutely pops on that blue background. It is gorgeous in person. Um, I had to get a couple manly prints, so this one is called Tobacco. Oh, I'm sorry, Manscaping. <laughs> Beard 
and pipes and sunglasses. My daughter loves fabric, so she's going to pull those all down right now. Oh, this is exciting. Uh, this is Ties in Graphite. And Michael Miller, I love him. One of my favorite fabric designers. Again, gorgeous in person. You can't even tell from the pictures what it really looks like. It's one of my favorite things about getting fabric in. This is the new Tula Pink collection. This one is called Pit Crew. I wasn't able to afford to get the whole collection, but it is, it, oh God, it's insanely gorgeous. And these are little snails, and they are the Pit Crew. The other prints have a hare and a tortoise. Oh no, she pulled on my fabric stone. <laughs> Sorry. Um, the others have a hair and a tortoise, and then there's some polka dot prints that are just insanely beautiful. If you have a chance, go to cottoncandyfabrics.com and check it out. It's a must-see. Oh, my goodness. Okay, this is a Into the Deep collection. It goes with the jellyfish print. It's a coordinating print um, by Michael Miller, and these are just, again, <laughs> you can't even tell from the pictures online what it's going to look like when it comes. It is insanely beautiful. And if you can see the detail that went into these little... Um, there we go, that's a little better. Oh, those are just gorgeous. They're done in turquoise and they have little bow ties on that are pink. <laughs> you can't even see those in the picture. Those are just it's beautiful. Uh, this is Periwinkle Mermaid Scales by Michael Miller. It's another coordinating print for the jellyfish. And I love anything mermaid, obviously. <laughs> and stunning. Uh, this is Fox Snap in Sorbet. Oh my goodness. It's gorgeous. Again. Can you see the detail? I have definitely turned into a fabric addict. Lydia is um, I'm pretty guilty of that. <laughs> but it's okay. She only offers quality fabrics, so I don't mind being a Fabric addict as long as what I have is quality, right? This is called Twilight. Um, it's by Michael Miller and Sarah Jane. Uh, she does the magic collection, but I don't think this is part of the magic collection. This is just gorgeous. There's a little girl and the trees look like they're lit up in a nighttime sky. Oh, insanely beautiful. Um, elephant walk fabric. This, I believe, is a Tula print as well. It might, uh, it might actually be a lily baby. I'll have to look it up after this. But again, another beautiful, beautiful print. Um, thread, another must have. Um, ribbons. I love ribbons almost as much as I love fabric. There's some pinks and some blues, blacks, coral, um, needles. Uh, this is my door fabric, which is another thing that I've gotten addicted to. This stuff is amazing. Um, it holds up to 10 times its weight in moisture. It wicks it away. <laughs> um, it's breathable and porous, and it won't hold moisture. It's washable. Um, it's thick, but not too, too thick. Kind of like, you know, terry cloth sometimes is a little too thick. This is just, it's lightweight, but it's super, super thick. Amazing. My daughter's getting into the stash of the rest of it that's down here. You want to say hi? Yeah. It's an eat and tater. So we might be a little messy. Look at the baby. Say hi, baby. Hi, baby. Look at that baby. There she is. Okay. Oh, my goodness. This is the galaxy print. I was super excited about seeing this. I think it's a something Beth Studio. I'll have to look up who it's by and put it in the in the description below. But that is absolutely gorgeous in person too. Um, what else we got? <laughs> Our movie's taking a little too long. This is called Jungle Friends Safari. It's like another one by Michael Miller. Like I said, I love him. Oh, his color is just gorgeous. What do you think, Sissy? You like the giraffes and the elephants? <gasps> Is that cute? She likes seeing the baby on the camera. All right. Oh, here it is. This is my double gauze. Oh, and it's so soft. So soft. 
Look at that. This is Mariposa Butterfly, double gauze. Oh, oh. and we're going to be making a baby blanket with it. It's perfect for a baby blanket. What do you think? Oh, it's super, super soft. I bet after I wash it, it'll be even softer. That is just gorgeous, too. See, I don't even know how they managed to get such a gorgeous print on such a lightweight material. Hi. All right. And then this is my navy flannel that's going to go in the back of my baby blanket. Kaufman, of course. Robert Kaufman. He is a designer and a genius. The genius behind the Kona color um, cotton line. And one more for the road. Unicorn herd. Look at that. <laughs> That's beautiful. Look at this. Oh my goodness. The grays, dark grays, light grays, white, and pinks. Absolutely stunning in person again. Another Michael Miller and I think that's it. That's all we have for today. We do have more coming in later this week, of course, because I can't help but order uh, at least once a week. Um, thank you very much for watching. Um, the link to my store is www.mermaidmamadesigns.com. I make mostly custom baby carrier accessories, but I do have ready-to-ship items as well, such as bibs. Um, soon to be baby blankets. Uh, there's a couple baby accessories that are ready to go too. Um, what else do we do? Shoes, headbands. Um, you can find all of my available fabric at bit.ly, so bit.ly slash mermaid fabrics, all lowercase, all one word. Um, and, and that is updated <laughs> as often as I get fabric, which is probably about twice a week now. Um, Thank you so much for watching, and all the links to purchase fabric or to see what the names are are going to be down below in the comments after I've edited this video. you have anything else to add? Thanks for your support. Have a great day.